Hey guys, what's going on? Max FD here, and today I'm back with another Pokemon Go video. Today, this is obviously a very different video to what you're sort of used to. We are in real life, yes, uh, out in the lovely summer sunshine of Aberdeen, and we're going to be giving a Bone Sweet Community Day sort of a run out, um, see what we can catch if there's anything good. Um, now, actually, having a look here, there isn't really that much. I've got one at the moment, not shiny. Um, just have a walk about and see what we can find, do a couple of tasks, uh, but yeah. So we're going to be seeing what the professor is saying, um, obviously your classic sort of community day research. Sweet surprise, five nice throws, 15 bound sweet, I don't, again, I don't know how you're actually supposed to pronounce it, but that's where we're going to be going with, and power up 10 times. Um, there was actually, I do have a lucky egg on at the moment, so I was actually wanting to claim that just now, which we will do. Um, get myself a free incubator as well. Little sort of small, oh, there we go, first shiny. Um, <laughs> 129 CP. I don't know if the IV is going to be a very good. CP, not actually very good. Bound Sweet itself and its evolution, not really going to be of any use. Um, not any use in raids, not any use in PvP. So it's more just sort of a, just sort of a filler community to be honest. You can have a quick look here. Uh, yeah, dreadful IV, and so again, no point holding on to. Going to be trying to look for those sort of nice throws that we needed for the tasks. I, I keep meaning to use berries and stuff. I've got quite a few tasks where I actually need to use berries for stuff, but it's just I just never use them. So it's actually remembering to use them. No shiny. Use our berry. No shiny. Use a berry, and we've got one more to check, which is also non-shiny. So for the last uh, set of tasks for stage one, we do actually just need to power up ten times. So we're just going to pick, find something uh, hundo that is, you know, could be decent enough to power up. Um, Salamance, we'll go for that. Just power it up a bunch. I didn't actually count. Hopefully that's enough. Yes, ten times sweet. So now we are able to actually get onto stage two of the research. Claim all that. Hope for something semi-decent. No, it is not. I'm gonna use a berry just because, again, still need to be using those berries. Um, working towards the the third master ball, actually. Still not used any of them. I mean, I've seen quite a few Galarian birds, but not really been any that I've sort of wanted to use it on, because I know that it will come eventually, so there's no point just using a master ball on them. Uh, see what we're up to now. Transfer 10 Pokemon, catch 15, and evolve 3. So again, that's 3, pretty reasonable as well. One thing I did want to do as well, while I've got an egg on, double check it is still on, yes it is. Uh, while I've got an egg on, I do have a few friendships, I think, actually ready to level up. Got my wee search string as well, which I find really handy for sort of friendships. Just makes it much easier finding it, as opposed to just wading through all your friends, working out how close they are. Uh, is that it? Yes, that's it. So we'll grab the XP from that, and then we'll carry on with the research. Oh, there we go, there's another shiny, 232. Don't know if that's gonna be any good, but like I said before, it's not a Pokemon that you need to worry about. It's not anything that is, I actually jumped out there. Um, yeah, again, it's not anything that you need to sort of worry about. Not use for anything, so. It's more of the sort of, oh, there's a dog barking. I don't know if you can hear that. Um, Semi-decent IVs. But yeah, it's more so the move that's getting added that sort of could be decent for things to come in the future. It's a pretty good move. It's just unfortunate that the Pokemon that is getting the move is pretty crap.
So with catching this final one here, one-handed uh, quick catch is so, so handy. That's us finished our next set of tasks. Sweet surprise, two out of four, and we do actually get a shiny from the research, which, which that's a nice bonus. Good chance of being quite good IV. Um, not actually sure. I don't. I haven't memorized the sort of hundo CP. Not actually 13, 12, th uh, 13 could be worse. I mean, shiny's a shiny at the end of the day, especially from research. We'll claim all these tasks here and get another regular one from the research, but make sure to get our berries done. Speak to Professor Willow again. What does he want us to do? Three great curveball throws, 15 Pokemon, and evolve a Steeny. Uh, again, pretty easy tasks, so we'll just jump into them here. So, like I say, the research wanted us to evolve a Steeny. Uh, this shiny burn sweet here, which is actually a 0, 7, 13, I want to say, it's going to be pretty high rank for the Ultra League. Again, even though it's not any use for PvP, it's just nice to have, just in case, you know, everything is uh, everything's only one move update away from being useful. So, we will up, uh, evolve this all the way, get the exclusive move, and hope that, you know, one day it might be useful. Shiny as well, so shiny high rank is always good. Um, better to have it than to not have it. So evolved all the way here, high jump kick. I actually thought it was a fairy type move. I didn't realize that it was a, a fighting type move. Pretty uh, neat that it actually guarantees the defense drop as well. I suppose that's going to be handy for sort of coming up against steel types. That, that could actually be semi-decent. I Yeah, I was totally under the illusion that it was a fairy type move, so that might actually be quite good. So I've actually already clicked on it, it's not going to be able to show the animation just because it is off a of lure, I don't want to risk it sort of running away. We do actually have a tiny shiny here which is, unfortunately it's not going to be huge which obviously we do want for the showcases. Tiny shiny though, still going to be pretty unique. Uh, 12 candy for, uh, though that was with a pin up, it must be double candy today. Um, XXS, not any use. Um, still cool though, still cool nonetheless. So with that catch there, that is our 15 bound sweet that we did need to catch. Stage 3 out of 4 complete, we'll claim all that. Japanese garden, that's just where we were. Uh, we'll go out right here. Squeeze through that door. Well, not the worst, 93%, 13, 15, 14. And claim this here. I'd like to guess this is probably going to be a Steeny, which it is. And with this here, I think this might actually be us finished the research. Yes, yeah, stage 4 out of 4, 15 Ultra Balls, two silver pineapps and it's gonna be another another one here and we'll get our last one here which is going to be the Serena t t t Serena I presume that's how it's pronounced and we'll get our raspberry and ultra ball going on here and is that gonna be any good IV probably not <laughs> yeah 10 10 11 just what we want and no good IVs from the other ones either and that is actually us finished the research. So, still got just over two hours left of community day. It's always nice to sort of get the research out the way so that you don't have to think about it. I did actually forget to do that with the Bagon community day. Um, I, I was just grinding like the entire time, just catching and grinding too hard that I actually forgot to finish the research. So we do still need two more Bagon and to evolve a Shellgon. Obviously, Shellgon, that's easy enough to evolve. Finding a Bagon though, not the easiest thing to do. Uh, but yeah, let's see what we can catch with the rest of Community Day.
So with this last berry here, this will actually be us finished. Stage one of the masterwork research being out for about a week now, I want to say, maybe slightly less. 2,500 XP and an encounter with Sandy Cast, which would be quite cool if it wasn't in your sort of daily research breakthrough and was what you got from it about 90% of the time, but better than nothing. Maybe it's a sort of good IV, probably not. Not that we're that bothered. Catch one out of 300 Pokemon, so that's obviously one of the next tasks for the research. 300 Pokemon, 100 great curveball throws, and transfer 50. So, maybe be close to getting that today. Probably not, to be honest, but we'll see how we get on. So this is probably going to be where we are actually going to wrap our community day up. Uh, having a look in here, see how many shinies we got. Uh, did end up with nine shinies. Not the worst, uh, not the greatest either, but shinies are shiny at the end of the day. Uh, community is a shiny, pro so probably we'll end up transferring a few of them just for saving space and stuff like that for GoFest. Uh, zero hundos, I believe. Yeah, no hundos. And uh, but yeah, that's about it for this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like. Obviously, this was a very different video. Um, if you sort of enjoy this sort of thing, let me know down in the comments below. Uh, again, it was sort of my first video like this, so obviously not going to be perfect. Uh, slightly awkward at times, probably. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya. Peace.